Archivematica 0.9 allows for the ingest of the Library of Congress Bagot format. First, I'll show you in our sample transfers, in our sample data folder, that we, we have both a sample unzipped bag and a sample zipped bag. I'll show you the contents of the unzipped bag and of the data folder within it. The zipped bag is the same as the unzipped bag, it's just zipped. In order to ingest the zipped or unzipped bag in Archivematica, simply choose transfer type on the transfer tab of the dashboard for either unzipped or zipped bag. In this case, I'll go ahead and run through the unzipped bag. For now, we'll just call it unzipped bag transfer. We'll browse to it in our sample data directory add it, and start transfer. While that's going, I'll start the unzipped, start the zipped bag, sorry. You'll see that when you select zipped bag, the ability to name the transfer goes away. You cannot rename a zipped bag in Archivematica 0.9. And then we'll browse to it in our sample data. select it, and start transfer. You'll see our unzipped bag transfer is awaiting a decision. We will select to approve the transfer, and we will do the same for the zipped bag. Now the bagged transfers go through the regular transfer ingest processes. The zipped bag is, of course, unzipped, and all of the same EUIDs that would apply to a standard transfer in Archivematica apply here. You'll see that the bag in both cases is verified and restructured for compliance with the Archivematica system. You'll see here in the zipped bag that packages have been extracted successfully and moved to their processing directory. And then the regular transfer microservices continue. And the same is true for the unzipped bag. Once all of the transfer microservices are complete, we'll have the opportunity to move on to the ingest tab. At that point, Zipped bags and unzipped bags are processed exactly in the same way as any other standard transfer in Archivematica. In the ingest tab, you would have the ability, of course, to add premise rights metadata and Dublin Core metadata and to normalize for preservation and access and ultimately store and provide access copies. That's it for Bagot Ingest. Thanks for listening.